All right, the Outer Wilds. You made that for me? Well, send it to me later, because I'm playing the Outer Wilds. Thank you. With a gamepad. And hopefully the gamepad works, because I plugged it in now. Anna Purna Interactive. That's a film thing. Very weird. Come on. What's your fucking deal, yo? All right. So. Okay, my gamepad is working now. Options. Uh, I guess default for all this shit. Uh, I guess master volume is what I want to change. You guys can hear this fine, right? I don't know what the dialogue volume is going to be like. Uh, well, we got text translator, freeze time. Okay, I don't know any of these fucking features yet. Uh, okay, I think we're good here. All right, let's do it. Is this blind? I'm I'm blind, which is why I don't wear clothes. Okay. I can roast a mallow. Oh, extend. Oh, fuck! <laughs> no! Get out of here. <laughs> Screwing up the game already. Oh my god, that's stupid! Fuck it up. All the time. Are we good? Turn brown. How come I can't rotate? This looks good. I don't like this dot in the center of my screen. There's our pilot back from your pre-launch camp out under the stars, I see. Okay, you're an alien boy. Interesting. So it's launch day, eh? Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program and suddenly here you you are, leaving on your first solo voyage. What to do, you say? Ready for this? To get this beauty off the ground? It's all fueled up and ready to go. You show you fixed the retro rockets. That was only a problem at one time, and then maybe a few times after that, but hey, no reason to dwell on the past, right? Anyway, you'll need to get the launch codes from Hornfells at the observatory before you can lift off. Just bring those here once you've said your goodbyes or whatever. Is the music guitar strumming too loud at the moment? Seems like it could be. I can turn it down. Lightly. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn it down. Launch codes. Okay. Woo! I like how my jump like charges up. <laughs> Like, there's no just, like, normal jump. You, like, have, have to hold it down a bit. Hmm. Oh, shit! This is weird. What the... F I screwed up. Damn it. Reset. <laughs> up and down thrust. Okay. Horizontal. Why is my left one stuck? Is my controller fucked? Hold on.
Okay, this is not working. <laughs> this controller's pretty old. Okay, so when I'm pressing... When I'm pressing the left trigger, it's making a noise. And when I'm not, it's not making the noise. Which leads me to believe that my controller is working still. What the fuck is going on?! So, like, when I first started, the, the first one I did didn't have these engines pointed directly down the entire time. I think that's what's screwing me up. Did it, like, did I break the game? Like, why is it... So, like, here's what's happening. When those things on top are on, I'm not pressing anything. And yet it's giving me a downward force to the point where, like, I'm pressing the right trigger, and theoretically this would lift me up off the ground, and it's not. This has to be a glitch. Like, it's, it's as if I'm doing both at the same time, but I'm not... Oh, there we go. Shit. <sighs> okay, now it's letting me, like, actually take off. This is very difficult. I don't know why it's doing that, though. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Guys! Okay. This- this we got. We fucking got this. Why aren't you going higher up?! Am I supposed to be anywhere? Supposed to like land it on this shit. Damn it. Whatever. What a landing. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's why Slate lets you fly the real thing, huh? That's a really passive-aggressive comment. hey -o, Hatchling. I hear you're leaving us to seek adventure amongst the stars. When you return, let's you and... You, me, and Gosan open up a bottle of the good stuff. Hmm. Another metaphor ruined in the name of scientific accuracy. Nevertheless, I do hope you enjoy your travels. Good luck. Porphy. You hurt my poor Fifi's. Okay, so if I'm this tall... Yeah, that's about right. I was about to say, the door seems a little tall for tor por Porphy. Oh, I have a flashlight. It's the same button as the Last of Us flashlight, I think. G nice! Hello there, Space Cadet. I hear you're leaving the crater today. If you met any of the other travelers up there, remind them to take proper care of their instruments, won't you? Hmm. It's up the path behind the waterfall. There are a couple of signs marking the way, but really, you just keep going up and then hook a right when you get to the Zero-G cave. Okay. Fuck! Fuck! Waterfall. That is not a waterfall. Or is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well... The launch pad is flammable! Don't worry, it's held up for all the launches so far. It'll definitely be fine for yours, probably. Hmm.
pilot seat used by pioneering astronaut Feldspar. I don't like any other names. Is all that remains of our inaugural flight into space. <laughs> this is an interesting setting. I, I like the... I like the tone so far. It looks like a game that was, like, made in Unity. Um, but I like the combination of the characters and, like, the architecture and the music. It's an interesting combination, all three of them. Oops. Uh, oh, and I'm dead. <laughs> Quick death. <laughs> you are dead. I didn't know I could die in this game. It seemed like a really, seemed like a really friendly game. I didn't realize I could die. I always managed to find. Oh, it's fucking. Oh my god. There's credits for dying. Just new expedition. I don't even get to... Okay, well I guess I don't need to talk to anybody this time. So, I do... Oh, what is this? Did I get to upgrade my jump at some point? Is this a, is this a real live die repeat? So I can get up there through that. Where's the water? Here's the waterfall. Oh, the obser <laughs> the observatory is on that sign that I walked past earlier too. That's funny. What with the radio? We wanted to play hide and seek, but Moraine won't let us borrow the signal scope because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Hey, hey, can we use your signal scope? Can we? Can we please? We'll even let you be it. Sure, let's play. Okay. Oh, I have two sets of eyes also. Okay. I wasn't sure if I was their species or not. I was just some random human bitch. Cool audio design here. Yo, bitch. It's kind of cool, though. I won. I'm happy. Thank you for playing. All right. Fishing rhyme, fishing rhyme, singing helps me pass the time. You leaving the crater, I guess we'll all be a little busier without you around to lend a hand. A big water plant, giants deep, that's where I'd go. <laughs> Tentacle? Wow. I don't know what that shadow was. Oh. What the fuck? Oh! 
That's just how quickly the sun moves here? No wonder it was dark earlier. That's pretty cool. I like that. Oh, that was like an eclipse for a second. Oh man, it's so cool with the shadows too. Okay. I guess I'm going to the observatory. That's what I need to do, right? Pocket of ghost matter, a strange and dangerous substance that's invisible to the naked eyes. The good news is that you can detect ghost matter with a camera. Okay. I was just trying to see if my controller was drifting or if that was the game. I don't know what that was about. I thought that was a boy. Favorite astronaut. Launch day at last. Huh, buddy? It's the Translator Tools Inaugural Flight 2. I'm so excited, it's making me nauseous. <laughs> Just think you'll be able to translate any Nomai text you want. Anywhere you are, the two of us put a lot of hours into inventing that tool, so don't break it, okay? Haha, <laughs> oh geez, do not break it. Huh, ignore me, okay? I'm just nervous. And I'm not even the one going into space. How are you feeling? I'm excited. I like how they say hatchlings. <laughs> just here for the launch codes. Fine, I'll look at the statue. Remarkably intact. I'll show you remarkably intact. Hmm, they don't even know about the species. Interesting. I wonder if that's like foreshadowing or something. What the? Does it move? It was on the other thing first. Okay. Conscious observation. Okay, so this is a reference to, like, quantum physics. Interesting. Change in my jewel pod. Hold on one second. Ugh. This is a cool game, though. It was recommended to me by Jared Gilman, who was the star of Moonrise Kingdom, <laughs> who watches my videos and told me I should play this game. But that was a while ago, and I didn't play it because I wanted to play it on PC, but it was just on Epic Game Store at the time, and I didn't feel like installing that.
Okay. Try it out! What do you mean? Holy, what the... Am I on the... Sideways on the... What just happened? Oh. Local gravity distortion. Okay. Only near it, though. That's pretty cool. What the f- okay. okay. Okay, so the- oops. So there are, like, different sentences here. Okay, and it, the, the- the things are moving around what it's scanning. I like that it just pulls it out automatically. I don't have to, like, James Bond through my different gadgets <laughs> trying to figure out which one I use. Okay. The moon's gravitational pull. Interesting. I like this game. So far, so good. Were you not going to give me the launch codes? Giants Deep. Okay. Oops. My B button, I assume, will be for back, but it's... Uh... Interesting. I guess I can't fall, as I've already determined before. Or else I die. Launch codes are back in the museum? Oh, I missed them? Oopsie. I didn't notice there was an upstairs, sorry. I only got three hours of sleep last night, and before that I got four hours of sleep the night before, and then the night before that I got five hours, so. Oh yeah, this. Here we are. Um, this isn't really upstairs, it's up ramp. So, uh, you lied. There's a ramp, it's not stairs. Okay, interesting. Dark Bramble. The zoom is really slow. So is pan view where you're attracted to all genders? Uh, I'm gonna wing it. I'm ready to die in space. <laughs> Launch codes. So, is there a save option anywhere? Or, like, what happens when I'm... Like, because I don't... I'm not going to beat this tonight.
Once I have the launch codes, I don't need to say. So if I died right now, would I get a checkpoint? Or do I go to the thing and then I get a checkpoint? Up. Oh. Hello, sir. Interesting. So that was what I just did. Is that a checkpoint? That was a checkpoint. Right? Hmm, that statue is definitely weird. Up! I'm dead! And he didn't even care. Okay, so now I don't get credits. Now I go back here. Okay, so I speed ran the game at first because I got credits for dying before I even got to this. <laughs> Wait a minute. So I have the launch codes, meaning I start the game with the information that I had before. Okay, so spe this was actually kind of a, sp a speed, speed run exploit because I didn't have to walk all the right way back. Right? So... So this is like find in rumor mode? What does that mean? Rumored entry. Okay. I'm suited up. Can I, like, can I launch the fucking ship or what? Buckle up, buttercup. So I suit up probably when I want to leave. Okay, a landing camera. Interesting. Uh, oh, here we are. Signal scope, unbucker, unbuckle, scout launcher. Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. Oops. Alright. Uh, where am I going? Uh, what is going on? <laughs> okay, here we are.
Okay, this is interesting. Giant's Deep. What if I just go into the sun? Let's do it! Ah! Did I died? <laughs> Well, I got the good ending, it looks like. He didn't even talk to me this time. What is that? Giant's Deep, let's do it. Autopilot, huh? Okay. That seems good. Is that a Banshee? Nope. Can I go here? What the fuck am I doing? Oh my god! Help! Oh my god, this is so weird! I'm like, underwater! What am I doing? Probably don't want to go to the core. Uh-oh. This is so weird and really cool! Oh, that's dope. Man, this is like a version of No Man's Sky that wasn't bad. I still haven't played No Man's Sky. Uh-oh. Okay. See what the fuck I'm doing here. There's stairs. There's fuel. I gotta like refuel at some point, I guess. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, it's those things. Can I make that? Oh! This is so cool! And disorienting. Ow. Brittle hollow projection stone. Oh no! Oh! I'm fine. What the... What the hell is happening?! Oh! 
What is going on? Oh. This is so weird, I'm gonna die. What do I do with this? Oh, fuck. Oh my god. So what am I doing with this? Do I just bring it with me? Is this all I wanted? Do I... <laughs> can piece it into slots and it gives text information. What slots? Slots in my ship or slots outside my ship? Because I, I didn't see no... I don't know what I was supposed to do with it out there. What do I do with this? Maybe, um... Okay, so it even shows me things like on different planets, right? Keep it? Well, where do I... Do I just leave it in my ship then, or what? Oh. So that's it. Okay, hold on. Finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are ready to send it into orbit around Giant Steep for assembly. All my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope, and I truly believe this cannon actually may have succeeded, while well, many other attempts have not. I know my brother. Blah, 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 blah. Net, whoop. Maximum power setting. Uh, da, 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 da. Orbital probe cannon. Okay, so there has to be somewhere else I can set this, then. I don't know where. Okay. Oh! What the fuck? What is... Okay. Why is it untranslated? Why can't I translate it? Oh, I have to hold that button. Oops. I was holding the wrong button. Come on. Ok, 
Okay, there's a tornado happening. I don't understand what's going on when this happens. It's so confusing. It's really cool. I don't get what this was all about either. What is happening here? Oh, there was like another... I can't go outside. Okay, whatever. My fuel is almost gone. Is my fuel just from, like, walking around, too? Kind of seems like it. I'm sure that I'll be able to, like, upgrade things later, probably, right? That's my assumption. My fuel is just jetpack? Alright. Well, why did my fuel level go... Like, it's going down at the moment, and I'm not pressing my jetpack. It's going down just by walking. So I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. And, uh, so what if I swap these two? Will it fit? Southern Observatory, Projection Pool. Okay. Come on! How close can I get to it? Just barely out of reach. I don't understand what's going on here. Projection. Oops. It's like I want to grab that, but it's just the same one that I have, though, right? I guess I can leave that. And there's like a third stone, right? It's like... So weird. So yeah, that's the same one. Is it? It looks different. And then what is that all about? It's just a projection? The idea is that you look around for clues. Yeah, well, I don't see... I'm trying to figure out, like... I don't know. I don't really feel like I got much of a clue from that. So this definitely means something. There's three... areas. One there. One there and one there. The ship area, I don't know which one of them it is. Yeah, we'll go to the ship log. Ah. 
Like, I could be exploring other planets. Or explore more on the planet I came from, too, right? Yeah, so this is where all my clues go. Okay. A path beneath the service that leads to the observatory. I'm constantly down thrusting? Okay, it might be a controller issue. Because that's what was happening to the fucking, uh... That's what was, was happening to the, uh... Drone thing I was operating. Is it was ca constantly down thrusting. So it might... Yeah, I think my... Oh, I see that. Yeah, my controller's a little fucky. I think th I've had this for like 10 years. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, I have another controller that I can use. Let's see how far I've gone in the recording because I don't know how late I'm going to stay up, really. 47 minutes. I mean, I think that's fine for like a part one or whatever. I might just try to go to bed early. Because Scoot's not going to be back for a couple hours anyway. And I, I'm going to be like... I'm going to I'm gonna have better ability at commentary next week. If I'm like well rested. I'm just like... I'm just so fucking tired. So I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to call it a night. I enjoyed this game though. But yeah, I'll play more of it. It'll be my single player game experience or whatever. Um... Yeah, I would like to go to bed. So I'll catch you guys. I'll catch you guys next week. Um, I'm going to try to sleep. I'm going to take more melatonin and see if it actually works this time. Um, I think what's been happening is like, even though I wear like a sleep mask, I think my brain is just like automatically waking up when the sun's out. Because um, there's like a little crack you can see like, you can tell the sun's out, even if it's, like, not super fucking with my eyes. But anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna go to bed and uh, record the podcast tomorrow and do some editing and work on a bunch of shit this week. And then we'll continue The Last of Us 2 next week. Anyway, oh, excuse me. Sorry. Yeah, I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye, everybody. Peace out. Love you guys. Bye.